apparently Jim Comey's family are really hard on the left for Hillary Clinton. They love Hillary Clinton. Now, nothing wrong about that per se. But now, in this second cut, I want you to pay attention to something. Because now Comey starts diving into the moral aptitude and moral, uh, you know, moral qualifications of President Donald Trump, which I find awfully odd giving his family's allegiance to the moral vacuum that is Hillary Clinton and the Clinton acolytes out there. Play cut two. You write that President Trump is unethical, untethered to the truth. Is Donald Trump unfit to be president? Yes, but not in the way I often hear people talk about it. I don't buy this stuff about him being mentally incompetent or early stages of dementia. He strikes me as a person of above average intelligence who's tracking conversations and knows what's going on. I don't think he's medically unfit to be president. I think he's morally unfit to be president. If you're right, what is the remedy? Should Donald Trump be impeached? Impeachment is a is a question of law and fact and politics. You're a citizen. You have a judgment. Yeah, I'll tell you, I'll give you a strange answer. I hope not. Because I think impeaching and removing Donald Trump from office would let the American people off the hook and have something happen indirectly that I believe they're duty bound to do directly. Whitewater, Filegate, Travelgate, Benghazi, the Clinton Foundation, Uranium One, the list goes on and on and on. And you, I'm sorry, but you put your, you put your wife on camera, okay? So she's putting herself out there too. I'm not attacking her. She has the absolute right to have a political opinion. I don't know her. She's probably a wonderful woman. But it's clear as day you're selling a book and you decided to involve your wife and your family's partisan ideology in there. They support a woman involved in some of the most devastating, destructive political scandals in the last two or three decades of American politics. And all of a sudden you're citing the moral qualifications of Donald Trump. Now, Liberals watch you go, oh, this is what aboutism. You're damn right, it's about what aboutism. Are you serious? Holding Donald Trump to his standard, you, can, you, you can't even come close to meeting with your own chosen candidates. And don't even talk about Obama. IRS, Fast and Furious, GAO, the VA scandal, the Spygate, the list goes on and on and on. Jim, you came off like a sanctimonious, pompous ass. You're 6'8, right? You came off like you were about 5'1. And that's an insult to short guys because they're taller than you too. That was really disgusting.